We're going downtown LA, getting a tattoo, getting some ink. Let's see it. Breaking the norms of society. Good representation of my life right now. That's Pratt. <laughs> That's Pratt. All right, my friends, we are now headed to LA. It's time to leave rainy Vancouver. And time to go to LA. Palm trees and sun and beaches. We made it. Airport bound. Okay, maybe it's not a good idea. Okay, this is not. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the final boarding call for Delta Airlines. No. All right, what up? So, for context, I'm going to the LA Fit Expo. So I'm going Ladies and gentlemen, this is the last and final boarding call to the Seattle. I'm Jay Paul Sucks. You are delaying this flight. If you are not here in 60 seconds, you will be removed. Last and final boarding call. Okay, so for context, I'm going to the LA Fit Expo, so I'm gonna be there for five days in LA. I'm gonna meet some people, I'm networking. It's pretty much just a business trip, but obviously by the title of this video, something a little different coming. Pretty much just a business networking trip, but obviously LA is a good time. Uh, yeah. So we're currently in the Vancouver airport. I'm gonna be in LA in three, two, one. We have arrived in LA. You know what it is. Feeling of landing in LA is always fucking amazing. It's only my second time here, but yeah, the feeling is amazing. Just heading over to the baggage claim right now, grab my baggage, and then we are off to meet the boys, meeting Farshad and Mason and then Chad, and then we're going to the Airbnb, um, catching an Uber there, but. All right, there we are. We got Mason. We made it, baby. We made it, we're at the Airbnb right now. Look who it is. Mr. Farshad, Father Farshad, Vin Diesel. <laughs> there he is, trying to get in. I don't think it's working very well though. Okay, okay. Let's go. This is pretty lit. All right. Quick in and out run, get some food. 12 o'clock right now. There we are. Woo, baby. What's good? You got, got the slides on too, eh? Yeah. Let's go, he's ready. What are these called again? Four by fours. What are these called? Four by fours. <laughs> four by fours, four patties in each. That's eight patties. A uh, shake, same thing with Mason, same thing with this guy. I'm already done though. All right, Mr. Morgan has arrived. Ooh, we out here. What's going on? We got the cameras, let's go. We got Venice Beach, California. We got wood on the ceiling. We got, we got white okay. countertops. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what is good? It is the morning right now. We got Brian that just arrived. Okay. Straight from Toronto. Another Canadian boy in the house. Got the fucking Americans over here. I drove to Toronto, chill. I'm actually headed to my tattoo appointment right now. Just gonna book an Uber. These guys are going to Zoo Culture. So I'm gonna go grab some food right now. Book an Uber. Let's get it. Water. Water. All right, I'm going solo. We're going downtown LA right now. Getting a tattoo, getting some ink. Alright, so I'm currently in Whole Foods right now, just about to get some food. Um, I'm no expert, but I do know that when you're getting ink done, you want to stay super hydrated and then also eat a big meal beforehand. That's what I'm doing right now, is find something to eat. Alright, so it is 30 minutes before my appointment right now. We got a little turkey wrap here, banana, sandwich. So this place I'm going to is called Salm Bleu. Pop it right here, but that's the tattoo place I'm going to. I found this dude on Instagram, his name's Just On Task. I just really like his work, so I'm getting something done by him. It's gonna be done on my forearm. Second tattoo ever. Let's get it. Yo, this is a vibe. Damn. It's my guy, Just. Hey. What's going on? I'm um, at Song Bleu Tattoo. Yeah, we just finished up. Take some photos right now in the sun. It's actually a good spot. All right, so I just finished up my tattoo appointment, so I'm now in the Uber heading back home. I just got some Chipotle. And I'm here with the Uber driver, and he's super lit. We're playing some bangers right now, so it's a good time. Yo, so we just got back. Chipotle right here. 
And I got a little hack to show you guys. So basically what you want to do is if you want to get the most out of your Chipotle is you get a big bowl and then you get a tortilla on the side. You eat half of the bowl and then you put the other half in a tortilla. Best of both worlds. Boom. Burrito here, bowl there. So I'm going to be explaining to you guys the tattoo I got and why I got it. Um, what the meaning is and everything right now after I eat. My guy, my guy, racking up the list for us. <laughs> Let's go. Let's see it. He started walking away once he got here. He's like, Let's see it. He's like, nah. This yellow lighting in here ain't it. My guy just got tatted. Let's see what you got. New tat check. Hold on. I can't even see it really. We need some light. You want a full yeah, explanation, so eh? Do my check ins. Just finished the bowl of Chipotle. Got some Sour Patch Kids. You know what it is? Um, here, so basically what it is is a butterfly yeah. breaking a chain. And so the chain kind of represents like breaking the norms of society. Yeah. And a butterfly is like, uh, you know, like a blossoming creature. So it's like, it's like leaving school becoming an entrepreneur and just like fucking chasing my passion and everything so it's like a good representation of my life right now that's frat <laughs> that's frat <laughs> the first thing is my guy Morgan. my guy bro yeah, yes sir yes sir yeah